They live and die by their clubs. MLS supporters will do anything to support their team. And some take their support well past the stands. The Dark Clouds are Minnesota United's oldest and largest supporter group, having stuck by the franchise through thick and thin long before the team came to MLS. Their support can also be found here at the Conway Community Center, which is headed by Minnesota native and longtime MLS player Tony Sana. And together, the two have impacted lives not only here in the Twin Cities, but across the world. The Conway Community, it's just our home. We have soccer fields and basketball courts. We serve over 30,000 meals here. We just try to serve the interests of the community. Silver Lining is the philanthropy arm of the Dark Clouds, basically. Part of the Dark Clouds mission is that we are contributing at least 50% of our charitable giving and charitable time is specifically soccer related. We have a Kick It Back program which we collect and redistribute gently used items. This is where the Dark Clouds are kind of like rock stars. They come deep. They'll come with like 20 people and they like to work. And basically they send, you know, 18 jerseys, shorts, ball, and basically a team can play soccer and have all matching gear, so it's very cool. To really see the impact and to witness it firsthand kind of was like, yeah, we're doing the right thing. We've already taken orders on certain communities that want shoes or uniforms. There's a lot that's going to go to Haiti. There's a lot of other people that go to Nicaragua, Puerto Rico now. You got to go to Haiti and personally see I did. all these things that get sorted yeah. handed to the people who need them. Yeah, I'll never forget seeing the joy on their face when they get these new shoes. And these are like, you know, one, two year old shoes, but to them it's brand new and they are so excited. It's pretty powerful. This is our end of the year party. We're at the silent auction table. This all raises money also for charity. So even at your end of the year party, you guys are raising money for the Sana Foundation? Yes. We see our players doing good stuff in the community, so we want to be on that same level. It makes me proud to call myself a player day support because they are not only just amazing fans, but good people. What he had started here, it was just an easy thing for us to get behind. It's taken off. Yeah. They're such good people. To see them just jump all in again was inspiring, it was special. It's fun being in the stadium, but this is even more like important. That is really sort of what drives a lot of us to come time after time. Supporting the United is easy, it's our team. Supporting the community gives it even more meaning. New or old, big or small, there are supporters throughout North America using their MLS fandom to really make their communities a better place to live. It's been a humbling experience to be invited in to see firsthand their passion and their selflessness. That's a wrap on this season of Beyond the Stands. In 2016, Wells Fargo awarded more than $12 million in grants to 1,500 community organizations and schools in Minnesota. And team members performed more than 163,000 volunteer hours. To learn more about the Dark Clouds and the Sana Foundation, you can check them out on Facebook.